seeds in the minds of some proactive ambitionary members of the community and guiding them to achieve it. We are truly indebted to our founder, Honorable Minister Ali Sabri, and all the stakeholders for their untiring efforts in making the dream of having a school of our own a reality. Dear Founder Sir, the entire community owes you a big thank you and words will be enough to show our gratitude towards you. We are all set to witness a remarkable event of the day, the launch of the magazine titled Excellentia to mark the incredible 25 years journey of our mother, Esselia Sri. Excellentia is more than just a school magazine. It's a platform that depicts the journey of Esselia Sri. As we celebrate our silver jubilee, it takes special significance showcasing the exceptional talents, achievements and voices of the Sri Lankan international school community. Before we officially launch the magazine, I would like to take you through the journey of SLI history. It is worthy reminding here that multiple competitions were conducted at school in order to mark the silver jubilee. From imaginative poems to meticulous calligraphies and admirable drawings, the school became too competitive and delved into the celebrated mood for many days. Out of all the events that were carried out, the video contest got the spotlight and we are going to witness the video that secured the first place. Ladies and gentlemen, here we go. The Sri Lankan International School is an educational institution located in the heart of Jen, Saudi Arabia. SLI Girls Dream is a non-profit organization managed by a dedicated board of management, elected by the parents of Sri Lankan students, and approved by the Ministry of Education. This video is going to go back in time and explore the captivating journey of our school. The history of SLI Girls Dream can be traced back to its establishment in 1998. The school started as an initiative by a group of Sri Lankan expatriates living in China. They realized the need for a quality education system that would fulfill the unique needs of the Sri Lankan community in China and ensure that students could continue their Sri Lankan curriculum while living abroad. The Sri Lankan community eventually went to their building, which was the very first Sri Lankan school in China. The opening of the school was on October 31st, 1998. The school started as a small institution, offering classes that followed the Sri Lankan national curriculum. After a short time, the parents and the students attending the same school elected the board of management to manage the school. The teachers taught in English while also teaching in Tamil and Sahara languages as separate subjects. The school prides itself in maintaining academic standards while emphasizing the importance of how parents approach to co directly and extracurricular pursuits is evidenced by the various clubs and societies actively operating in the school. The following year, after the school's establishment, extracurricular activities and events took place for the very first time. The first teacher house sports group was held in November 1999. After a course of time, the school steadily grew and evolved. More Sri Lankan people migrated to China and enrolled their students to join our school. SLISJ now had more students, and they noticed that the students lacked motivation as their efforts were rewarded. Eventually, the board of management realized that they needed to organize an event, specifically in the morning ceremony, to recognize the talents of the students. The day of the first awards day is not known, but pictures from a later date have been planned. This picture was taken in March 2007. Many visits have been made by Sri Lankan officials to appreciate and monitor the progress of the Sri Lankan expatriates in China. The school continued to grow, hiring new teachers, and electing a new board of management every few years. The only thing that never changed is that the school takes pride in maintaining high academic standards and producing students who are the in the classroom. Almost another two decades passed from the first awards day, and SLI SJ continued to grow. The government of Saudi Arabia decided to destroy all buildings and construct new ones. The school building happened to be young one. After all, it had been almost two decades since the Sri Lankan community rented out the building. To continue educating their students, the school officials decided to shift to a new building. 
percentage of students are all players in the new school. As the light has changed, we saw produced a number of students, some from their own level, A's level, and A level exams. This founder's day at the Swing Market International School is a tribute to the visionary founders who planted the seeds of education and cultural preservation. It is a showcase of the school's commitment to academic excellence, cultural diversity, and community integration. Most importantly, it is a reminder that the legacy of the founders lives on. Generations of students and leaders who have passed through the halls of SLISJ. I'm proud to be a student of SLISJ because the school provides equal opportunities to every child. The school also inspires everyone to work their best when they encourage talent. Our school also promotes leadership. Recently, we have introduced a reflection of the students. I hope the school will continue to flourish under the guidance of our wonderful principal, board of management, and teachers. We all need to know our school sister and see how far it has come. We should be proud to be a student at this wonderful institution. Now, with great honor, we invite our chief guest, Honorable Ali Sabri, President's Council, Minister of Foreign Affairs, Sri Lanka, Guest of Honor, His Excellency, PM Amza, Ambassador of Sri Lanka to the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, our special guest, Mr. S. M. Farah Al Habshimaulana, Consul General of Sri Lanka in Jeddah, the Chairman, Mr. Sinan Bashir, and the members of the Management Council, our beloved Madam Principal, and the Head Prefect, Josie Infanta, to launch the magazine on stage. We would like to invite the past members of the Board of Management to join us on stage. Now, now the head prefect is giving the first copy of the Silver Jubilee magazine to the chairman who will then hand it over to our honorable minister Ali Sabri, Minister of Foreign Affairs in Sri Lanka. General of Sri Lanka in Jeddah is also receiving the copy of Excellentia. <laughs> to commemorate the official launch of the school magazine Excellentia, we have a delicious cake prepared. Distinguished guests, we request you all to gather around as we prepare to cut the cake and share the joy of this special moment together. We would like to invite the parents to extend their support by purchasing a copy of the magazine, which will be available at the stalls at the entrance. Thank you, sirs. Thank you, madam. <laughs> 